This week, I'm addressing an issue that I see in a lot of the athletes I coach, and I'm not gonna lie, it kind of drives me a little bit nuts, okay? And it has to do with the arm movement when the athletes are going to hit. So what I see a lot is athletes that will go, you know, most you know, of them being right-handed, they'll start with their left foot, and then what they'll do is they'll bring their arm, you know, really up high on their first step, and then back and then front again to make their jump. The thing is, your feet are always going to adapt to the speed of your arms. So if your arms take a really long time to do this three, these three movements, front, back, front, your legs are going to slow down to allow you to do these three movements, okay? So what's gonna happen is that lots of athletes are going to go to hit a ball that's set a little bit low and because they'll be doing this you know big movement up like this up they'll get there late they won't have time to actually swing at the ball so one thing if you're a coach that you can tell your athletes is to start with their elbows by them by their body and to not actually lift the elbows in front of their body on their first step so what they could do is just practice starting like this up on the first step and then quick back in front on the last two steps to jump, okay? You will notice it, okay? As soon as you start looking at your athletes and looking for those arms coming up, you will notice it and try to teach your athletes to keep their arms by your side. If you are an athlete, well, try it, okay? And you will notice a big difference, I promise.